know someone we can ask him. Espo, what happened? I twisted my knee when I was tackling lightning. Are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'll be fine. I just, uh, I just tweaked it. It's probably a sprain. Oh, it's too bad. I was looking forward to beating you in the talent competition. Oh, you think this is gonna take me out? Yes. Yes, I do. No, it's still on. Uh, yeah, I, I mean, how? I suppose you can barely walk. Yeah, and even on one leg, Ryan and I are still gonna whip your sorry asses. In fact, how about a wager? Uh, uh partner, you know, maybe we, we should discuss that. Uh -uh. If we win, then you will dedicate your next book to Esposito and Ryan. Two guys who are funnier, handsomer, and better than me in every way. <laughs> oh, you're serious? And if Becca and I win? Well, then Ryan and I will call you King Castle for a month. Hey, Javi. I mean, it's... <laughs> what do you say? Yeah, you know what? I think Ryan's right. I mean, we don't need to make a bet out of this. Why? Because you're chicken? No, because I am a grown-up. Yeah, a grown-up chicken. I will also accept your royal highness. You're on, Kimby. Ooh, that's clever. My work was what you give me. I'm gonna take you down. With what, your crutches? Can we get back to the dead guy? You said that you found someone who could tell us why Richie missed work yesterday. Yes, I pulled his phone and financials. There were no charges on his credit card yesterday, but he made a call. The only call he made from his cell all day. To whom? Someone he hasn't called in years. His ex-wife, Elise Reznor. 